This is Grave Confessions from the Grave Talks. Daily, raw, real, and disturbing accounts of the living, interacting with the dead. To share your grave confession, experience with the paranormal, supernatural, or the undead, call toll-free 888-GHOST-13. That's 888-446-7813. Now, today's grave confession. My name's Sierra. I'm recording this from Yuma, Arizona. I recently started listening to your show probably a couple of days ago, and I just wanted to share some of my experiences with you. Um, They have to do with my grandparents and the passing of them. Um, For as long as I can remember from my childhood growing up, my grandfather had cancer and he battled cancer for a good 17 years. And there was a particular year, and 2007 was a year actually, that he got terminally ill and we were in and out of the hospital for him a lot. Mind you, I was probably in high school and still a very active dancer, and but he was always too sick to go to any of my shows. But I understood. Um, but there was a particular night where I had seen him at the hospital and I told him, all right, Tata, I will see you tomorrow. And he kind of looked at me and he's like, well, maybe you won't. And I was like, oh, don't talk like that. You know, I'll see you tomorrow. Good night. And that night I went to bed and I had a very vivid dream that I was on stage dancing and he was on stage left watching me the whole time. And all I can remember was dancing my heart out in this dream. And at the end of the routine, I go to stage left to exit and I was hoping for him to be there but there was just a nurse there she kind of looked at me solemnly and shook her head kind of as if to say you know he didn't make it so I actually woke up to a knock on the door and it was my father stating that my grandfather had just passed And I kind of didn't know what to make of the situation. Um, Ever since then, I kind of always have him in my dreams. And I know he's not supposed to be there. I know he's gone. So every single time, it kind of hurts a little bit. But he he visits me constantly. Um, So that's pretty cool. Moving on to my grandmother, his wife. Through this past year, actually, these past couple months, she's been battling... Um, her illness she became terminally ill as well and we had her in her home her last week of life on hospice Um, when she was here she was kind of going through the transitioning process you know seeing loved ones hallucinating and so on and so forth it was it was rough um, to see her go through that transition Um, I was her caretaker, myself and my mother, so we did, um, have to deal a lot with helping her and, you know, taking care of her and, um, I guess the day we kind of felt like it was going to be her day, we didn't want to leave her side. Uh, the moment that we did, I went to take a nap because we had been up with her all night And my mom just went to go do a load of laundry. Actually, that night, the nurses had told us she might not make it through the night. So we stayed up with her all night, and she did. So that following afternoon, we were both kind of tired. And I just went off to take a nap. And my dad actually stayed in the room with her. And he witnessed her final breath. Going on to a couple days later, you know, I expected... A dream from her as my tata did. I thought, you know, maybe she'll come to me in my dreams as well. And she never did until that night. I think I cried my eyes out just wanting to know if she was okay and if she was at peace. And as I fell asleep that night, I was dreaming of like an escalator kind of going over an ocean. And the ocean was not too rough just a very high tide I guess and as I was going over this escalator in the ocean I met my grandmother at the end 
And she didn't say anything to me. She just smiled and she looked beautiful. And I guess that was her way of coming to me and letting me know that she was okay and that she had passed. So I just want to thank you for your time. I really enjoy your show. And that's my story. Thank you, guys. This has been a Grave Confession. From the Grave Talks. To share your Grave Confession experience with the paranormal or the undead, call toll-free 888-GHOST-13. That's 888-446-7813.